Welcome to Goodwe Training Series. Today we will take you through the ES Unix Series unboxing and installation. Unboxing. Here is the ES Unix Series box. In the box, there is a delivery impaction report, COM cable for battery and meter, lead acid battery thermo sensor cable, mounting plate, communication module. Here are the components. Introduction of the inverter. Take a look at the appearance of ES Unic from different views. Width is 561 mm. Height is 445 mm and the depth is 226 mm. Here is the new logo, W. Here is the LED indicators of the inverter. And here is the parameter label of the inverter. Bottom views of the ES Unic. There are many ports. Installation of the inverter. Before doing any further process, please keep the DC switch off. Here are the main tools prepared for the installation of the ES Unix series. Now, we need to fasten the mounting plate to the wall. Then hang the inverter on the mounting bracket. After it, do not forget to tighten the safety screw. And fix the ground cable on the inverter. Preparation and connection of DC side. Use wire stripper to strip the wire insulation layer to a suitable length. Then insert the wire into the terminal. And compress it tightly with crimping pliers. Insert the wire into the positive DC connector. And use the PV tool to screw up tightly. Same process on the negative DC connector. Then unplug the MPPT protectors and insert the DC wires. Preparation and connection of AC side. Strip the wire insulation layer of each AC wire to a suitable length. Insert the striped wire into the OT terminal. Then compress it tightly. Blow the tube tightly with a heat gun. Remove the protective cover. Replace protective gasket. Pass the AC wire through the protective cover. Unplug the AC cover. Connect each AC wire into the corresponding position. And screw them tightly. If there are backup and generator connections, connect them to the corresponding interfaces. Install the buckle and put on the AC protective cover. Tighten the screws with a screwdriver. Preparation and connection of battery side. Strip the wire insulation layer of each cable to a suitable length. Then insert the wire into the terminal. And compress it tightly with crimping pliers. Open the battery protective cover. Pierce the waterproof membrane with a screwdriver. Insert the wire into the positive battery connector. And use the battery tool to screw up it tightly. Same process on the negative battery connector. Close the protective cover and tighten the screws at battery side. Crimp the battery connector to the cable tightly. The same steps to prepare the negative side. Communication connection. Good we provide a 10 meters cable with CT as default. These are the positive and negative poles of the CT cable. Take off COM cover and pass the BMS communication cable and CT cable through the waterproof plug and tighten it. Put CT communication cable into communication terminal and tighten the screws. Plug the BMS communication port into the inverter. Plug the communication terminal into the corresponding port. And put the cover on. Plug the other side BMS cable into the COM port of the battery. Insert Wi-Fi slash LAN kit 2.0 module. If the distance between inverter and distribute box more than 10 meters and less than 25 meters. Please extend the CT cable. If the distance between inverter and distribute box more than 25 meters. Please use Smart Meter GM110. Then we can start the commissioning of the inverter now. Commissioning via SolarGo. First, you need to download SolarGo app. Open SolarGo app and connect Bluetooth. There will be some basic data of inverter on home and parameters page. Click parameters. You can see many parameters of the device. 
Click setting and choose communication setting network setting. Connect the WLAN. Enter your network password. Click basic setting. Enter password 1111. Don't forget to select battery model. You can choose working mode and click next. Click complete and click confirm. Then the device can run normally. That's all for the ES Unic unboxing and installation. Thank you for watching. For more installation and configuration videos of Goodwe training series, please visit our Goodwe community and stay tuned to our official account.